bought a bunch of these like little snack Ziploc baggy things and I'm going to fill them up with candy. We only need the two of us together. I need only you in this crazy world. Cause we got love, love. I need only you here with me. You wanna get close to me? Why don't you do it right now? No, we met for a reason, but you're trying to deny That we should be together, it's heavy weather We're heading for tonight You better take what you can, cause the time is right now We only need Good morning, happy... Monday. <laughs> happy Monday, it's been a long weekend. Tried to cheer up Arlo yesterday, uh, cause you know, I told you guys her aunt passed away on Saturday. So we watched a movie, um, it was called No Hard Feelings, and it was with Jennifer Lawrence from The Hunger Games, so good, funny, 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 so funny, it's on Netflix, so if you see it, watch it. I'm trying to bond Raymond and Arthur because they're the two single piggies that lost their partners in the last three weeks. And they just look so lonely. So I'm, I don't know. They have really big uh, personalities, those two. <clears throat> like, I don't know which one is going to actually back down and let the other be dominant. So we'll see what happens. I don't know. Uh, I'm going to put them on the floor, though, uh, in like a little pen that I have that's like a play pen. And we'll see what happens. I don't know. If they fight too much, I'm going to have to separate them. But well, I guess we'll see. I just don't want them to be lonely. Okay, so this is the big thing that I have. And I'm giving them parsley. They're eating nicely together. They humped each other about 500 times. So, you know, so far so good. I'm going to probably do this for the next two weeks. Every other day or every day so they get used to each other and... Then I'm just going to put them in a big cage together so that they can be partners. All right, here's lunch. We have uh, lettuce uh, boats with chicken, chicken salad, tomato, uh, uh, one hard boiled egg, a crispy bread with some homemade pimento cheese, and then pork rinds. That's it. All right, got the beef going on for dinner. This is the beef bulgogi. It's been marinating all day. I made some cauliflower rice. I'm making like a fried rice out of it, I'm trying to get all the moisture out of it. And then I've got some green beans back here with garlic. Whoa, garlic and oyster sauce. So this is the end result. This is the beef bulgogi. I made the rice cauliflower fried rice, got green beans. I showed you all that. And then we're going to have it with kimchi. I'm excited. All right, so this is what's happening. I am going to, I have those two baskets back there from the dollar store and then we bought a bunch of these like little snack Ziploc baggy things and I'm going to fill them up with candy and then we're going to put the bags in those baskets and then we're going to hand them out to the trick-or-treaters tomorrow and yeah I'm going to sit you on the table in a few minutes and talk to you but it's probably not going to be that long but just to show you what I'm doing give you a, a little sneak peek All right, all done. I did both baskets and they are full and heavy. So all the candy is portioned out and ready for the kids. Happy fucking Halloween. Here's breakfast. Looks like a bunch of, I don't know, this looks crazy. But these are egg whites, a really dead avocado, some crispy bread, which is just seed cracker. It's a big seed cracker. It's from Aldi. They have it at Trader Joe's. 
and bacon. That's that's uh, lunch today or brunch, and then we have uh, a bang energy drink. So I just got finished cleaning. Cleaning? No, I just got finished. Let me put you on the counter here. Feeding the guinea pigs because I do every other day a salad for them. I used to give them a salad every day, but um, I don't do that anymore. I give them a salad every other day. Uh, yeah, so they cannot have it every day. It's just, first of all, it's just too much in my opinion for them to be eating. I just feel like they don't need to eat that much. It's crazy. So let me flip up the screen. So yeah, now I'm just gonna, I'm gonna chop up some mushrooms. Let me go rinse these fuckers off. And I'm cutting mushrooms because I'm making a uh, beef stroganoff with sauteed cabbage underneath. So that should be good. It's from the Keto for Foodies cookbook. It's like the best cookbook there is when it comes to like keto. Other than if you want to cook, you can just kind of keep it simple. But this cookbook here, come on, focus, bitch. Focus, see it right there? This is the best cookbook ever. The recipes are amazing, they're tasty, and they're just good. So I'm just kind of prepping. I'm gonna chop up the meat. I already did that, so I'm just doing that. And then for the meat we have, we bought two, we bought uh, these beef chuck eyes. Chuck eyes, very, very like tender. So we have two of those that I'm just going to slice up and cube up and uh, put those in a bowl and then probably just season up whatever the recipe says to do. And then I'm going to cook the meal before we hand out the candy because once Samantha gets home, I have to do her costume. I'm not going to have any time to do any of this. So that's what I'm doing right now. All right. We handed out all of our candy. We actually, it's gone. So that's great. So this is dinner. This is from the Keto for Foodies cookbook. This is the beef stroganoff underneath some lettuce, lettuce, cabbage, cabbage sauteed cabbage, and then a wedge salad, but not with blue cheese, homemade ranch, and then I used goat cheese instead of blue cheese. So it's my wedge. Hello. So Arla, did you enjoy your dinner? Sure did. She enjoyed it. Delicious. She enjoyed it. She loved it. She said it was good, which I'm happy for. Make sure you unplug that. You keep leaving that plugged in. Mm. Oh. Nova Ray. She's under the fucking chair. Anyway, we had a nice time outside. I gotta put my keys back in my... Back in my pocketbook. So, you're just gonna be like looking up. Enjoy yourself. Enjoy yourself looking up. Anywho, it was a nice time, but now I'm tired. Like, not tired as in I can go to sleep, but I just need to sit down. I'm about to smack Google right in the fucking head. Anyway, Samantha is trick-or-treating. Um, I can't show you what she looked like because she doesn't want to be on YouTube. So you just have to imagine Samantha as Snoop Doggy Dog. Or if you're on our Instagram, you would have already seen it. And if you're not on there, then I'm sorry. I've been telling you for years to get the fuck over there. <laughs> and if you don't want to go, that's your problem. Not mine. Um, anyway. Oh, God. I have to sit down. Um, Sam is at, Sam is at her friend's house. We have to go pick her up at 10. And, uh, and then I'm done for the day. We're going to have a little bit of rubble ice cream. And that's it. I'm probably going to be watching like some TikTok or something because I haven't really been on there all day. So I kind of want to catch up with my people that I watch on there. Arlo has cl Crocs on. I want to let you know that. Um, let me show you what they look like. I have a pair too, but I don't have the lined ones. Mine are like a beige pair. Arlo's is silver. They say <laughs> Crocs. I'm not in it for the they're, they're only indoor, by the way. That's why I'm holding the bottom. Um... But yeah, so they have lot. They're lined, like because my feet are cold. Yeah, she's always cold. And my old slippers are like wet noodles. They're fucking horrible. They're horrible. So I'm happy she bought those. She needs support and she needs warmth. 
that brings happy Wednesday we are so tired mm. uh, I'm gonna make some coffee I'm freaking exhausted oops I don't even have you guys in the frame anyway we're tired from yesterday it was a long Halloween but it was good anyway this is the coffee I use the only one I use because it's so good unless I want like a flavored coffee and you guys already know the obsession I have with owls so I'm gonna put some skinny syrup in here and then put it to brew and voila off we go there's the goods oh I cannot wait to have this so I haven't vlogged much today um, we got our cats ashes back Georgie so just hasn't been that great of a day but this is dinner tonight it's just I roasted a chicken in the oven so I have the breast and then a loaded broccoli side of loaded broccoli and then a salsa water and that's pretty much it <laughs>